Steph Curry wrist, Oakland. Perkins for the Standing ovation in the uh. Make some noise! Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the Henry Goodman Arena in the Wallstein Center. Fans now making their way to center court are Cleveland State University President Dr. Ronald Berkman, head men's basketball coach Gary Waters, and a former Viking who played from 2007 to 2011 and currently a New Orleans Pelican standout, Norris Cole, for a special pregame ceremony. This is truly a great moment. You know, when you're here and you see all the people here that's here to support Norris, this is outstanding. Throughout your coaching tenure, there comes along a player that defines everything you believe in as a coach, and this is Norris Cole. Let's give Norris a hand here. I don't want to leave you out back there because you're part of the festivities as well. We are here today to honor and retire the jersey of one of the greatest players to wear a Cleveland State uniform. Norris, who is known for his work ethic and his ability to lead a team, is truly deserving of this honor. Norris received many honors during his tenure at Cleveland State. He was the only player in the Horizon League history to be chosen as Defensive Player of the Year as well as player of the year in the same season. As a senior, he was the only player in the country to average more than 20 points, five assists, and five rebounds. And you know what? That was very memorable to me because in that season, one game he went for 40 points, 20 rebounds, and nine assists, one short of a triple-double. It's no wonder that he was an AP All-American and a finalist for the Bob Cousy Award as the nation's top point guard. The one that won it that year was Kimber Walker. So you, many of you remember him from Connecticut. That tells you the, the company that Norris was in. Just to give you a few of his other career numbers, he ranked second in career victories, 90. Second to only his teammate, Jerry Montgomery, with 91. <laughs> Third in points, 2,978. Third in free throws, 485. Third in free throw percentage. That tells you how important free throws are, and they better shoot them well tonight. 82.6%. Uh, Fourth in assists, 455, and seventh in steals, 207. Now, you tell, that tells you how well Norris played. <laughs> Norris also guided the program during his tenure to three postseason appearances, including in 2009 NCAA tournament, where he scored 22 points in the first round as, as Cleveland State beat Wake Forest. Now, how important was that? At that moment, Wake Forest was number six in the country, and that tell you how well the team played at that time. It's not often that a number is retired, but this is a well-deserved honor and achievement for, for one of the most well-rounded, humble players I have ever coached. Congratulations, Norris. You deserve it. And now, and now with some more words about Norris Cole, our president, President Rod, Ronald Berkman. Thank you very much, Coach. It is not only a special day for Norris Cole and for Kelly Klein, whose number we will retire at halftime, it's a special day it's a special day for Cleveland State University, for Cleveland, and for Northeast Ohio. 
I'm going to keep my remarks very short. Nora says he yeah, has an appointment at the queue tonight. Um, all of you know that Norris was drafted in the first round by the Miami Heat, went on with the Miami Heat to win two NBA championships. And one of his teammates here to honor him today, LeBron James. I'm going to take one liberty and tell a little story about uh, Norris that I, I've told them, but Norris has told her a lot of stories, and that is that uh, my son worked as a sports writer in New York, and he had an assignment to do a one-on-one -on -one interview with Dwayne Wade. And he went to Dwayne's house, and he talked with Dwayne, and at the end of the interview, at the end of the half an hour, he said, you know, my dad is the president of Cleveland State University, and of course, Norris came from Cleveland. And Dwayne went on to say, and this really does epitomize what the coach was talking about, that, that you know, all, all rookies who come into the NBA come in with skills. They're all talented. What makes them successful is not their talent, but their character. What makes them successful is their willingness to understand that life and basketball are continuing learning exercises, and Norris Cole epitomizes that. Uh, he has the character and the breath and the depth to be a great performer. And one of the things I'm most proud of with this program and most proud of what Coach Waters and his staff is that Norris is one of almost every single, every single player in this program to finish the university with a degree. <laughs> Norris never really left Cleveland State. He's on a sabbatical. He returned last year on our 50th anniversary, gave an amazing talk to his fellow students, and was the Grand Marshal for our 50th anniversary celebration. Now, Norris, it's our turn to honor you. Norris is only the third alumnus of our men's basketball program to have his number retired. Joining Franklin Edwards, number 14, and Ken Mouse McFadden, number 10. Congratulations, Norris. Let's raise his banner and show number 30 how proud we are of him. Norris may be the first player also to unveil his own uh, number. I thought that was a cue to unveil the number. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for Norris Cole. I just want to say thank you to everyone who showed up today. Thank you for supporting the other student athletes. Thank you for coming to support Kaylee. And thank you for coming to support me. I want to give a special thanks to my parents, my family from Dayton. <laughs> I want to give a special thank you to one of my championship teammates, LeBron. And I want to give a special thanks to my team, the New Orleans Pelicans, who came to support me today. Throughout my four years here at Cleveland State, you know, I was able to grow in a lot of many areas, you know, academically, physically, on the court, and I was able to mature as a man. You know, thanks to Coach Waters and the, and the staff here, the professors, the tutors, you know, and I think it's pretty cool now to be able to look up in the rafters and see my name and number go up. <laughs> um, some of the special memories that I have here, 
right here on this court. You know, games where we beat Butler. <laughs> yeah. Here in downtown Cleveland and uh, North. Teammates were able to fight together. Games where Coach killed us in practice. And I just want y'all to know that I'll never forget Cleveland State. It'll always be a part of me, and everywhere I go, I'm going to make sure I represent right. Thank y'all for coming. All right, fans, how about one last round of applause for number 30, North Cole.